What will I miss about him? Oh, Lord. He was a loving, caring person. How do you feel these days? Wow. I feel sad. I feel a little angry. And I shouldn't be angry, but that's just the way I feel. I miss my brother. Um, but, you know, he had a good life. And, and one of the hardest parts about it is that, you know, it wasn't, it wasn't the life I would have had for him. All right, on a mission. My cousin Renee said she wanted to have some video as we go to clear out my brother's storage unit. This is the beginning. I wanted so much more for him, but when I look back at it and see his friends on Facebook and everything that he's done with his associates or friends or whatever they are, it's, he's always been a positive influence on them. The gloves. Ready? Oh! Sesame! This is Peter's stuff. Peter did stuff. He fixed stuff. He made stuff and fixed stuff, so he has tools. We're going to scrap it just like he would. I keep waiting for him to come walking in my house. <laughs> He was always there for me if anything ever needed fixing. I knew I could call Peter. He he was just, whenever you needed him, even if you hadn't talked to him in months or whatever, you call him and he'd come. He was my favorite uncle. Let me see you lick the bowl again. Don't shake me. Okay. Good job. That's the way you do it. And you get it all that way, huh? Go ahead. You can get it some more. He was always the, right. the fun uncle. Playing video games with us. He got my friend hooked on one of one of his games that, that he was big into. But from being a kid all the way up till we were growing up, he was he was always the, the fun uncle. I feel like me and him can relate a lot with a bunch of different things. And like I said before, like the main thing was I felt like I could literally talk to him about anything. He was always funny and he always, you know, had a smile on his face. And that's, um, I think that's what I will miss at the family events is, um, is him it, making everybody laugh. Mwah. Mwah. A lot of times he could have been misunderstood. Mwah. Mwah. But he was I know all of us as a family, we saw where his heart was. He always, wanted all of us to succeed. Say everything that you wanted to say to him. Oh no, I feel totally cheated. I, I didn't want him to go. We just had a lot of things we wanted to do. The thing that was so beautiful that I heard someone say about Peter was that he didn't make friends, he made family. Mm -hmm. remember that he, he's a lot like my father, but I am too. So I remember that we butt heads a lot. <laughs> but we, you know, we got over it. My, being in our house, my husband was always the inter intermediary between the two of us. He and my husband were great together. I married Carla, but Peter was my heart. What were you missing about him? Um, just him in general. Um, he was a good, good person, good spirit. Um, just fun, loving guy. He's always really supportive, and that's, um, so you always wanted to know kind of what we were up to you, and was always very much like, oh yeah, you got this, and so probably that. It's been a long time since I sang. Here's to 
the kids who are different, the kids who don't always get A's, the kids who have ears twice the size of their peers, and noses that go on for days. I'm not a touchy-feely person. So sometimes I wish I would have hugged him more, or I said I love you more, or things like that. But I know that he, he knew that. I know that he knew that. What will you miss about him, Ricky? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take him with me. I ain't gonna miss him. You know, Peter was Peter. It means rock. So I'm just, I spend a lot of time with the rock. I'm gonna keep spending a lot of time with the rock. You said that you probably hadn't said all the things that you wanted to say to him before he left. So what what would you say if he was still here? I don't know. I mean, we still have a lifetime to talk, you know? We'd still have a lifetime to grow old together. We'd have a lifetime to go fishing or maybe get closer in our relationship. He loved his family. Yeah, he really did. Oh. <laughs> I'm relieved that Peter is, he's, he's at rest. He gave his, his healing process as much as he could give. Um, um, he, he, gave he gave it a good shot. He, he gave it a good shot. It sounds like family. Definitely family. He was my brother, <laughs> you know? He's my brother. My life's been full.